hello everyone welcome back i wanted to show you this quick video on a project share so i am participating in creative and the crafty life's uh altered canvas swap so um my partner's name is lillian and she is uh i don't know if she has a youtube channel but if she does i'll put her information in the description box below but um we had to alter either a no no smaller than a six by six canvas but no bigger than eight by eight so i happen to have these little canvas panels in my stash and uh, they look like this i don't know if you can see it has the plastic on them so they're just flat really hard canvas like you can't bend them or anything so i just happened to have these in my stash and i i was hoping one day i'll be able to use them and i did i think i'm probably going to make a um maybe use these as a um uh um oh goodness what was i thinking a album couple cover on the cover on an album so as you can see my fingers are all icky so because we had to create mixed media and um, we had to use mixed media in our uh, altered canvas as well as um, incorporate flowers. Um, it was really broad. I know she, they mentioned something about spring and all that kind of stuff. So what I did was I kind of just did a little bit of everything and tried my best at this mixed media thing. Because the last mixed media thing I did, I don't think I swap partner like that. So, <laughs> so I tried to really, you know, you know, incorporate but still make it pretty which i thought i was doing last time but anyway that's another story in itself so this is what i what my um my project looks like let's sit it right here and um because it wasn't like the other one that has like the boxes it's like a like a like a little ledge on it i um i'm sorry i see this here i gotta take that off but i um so i added this to so she can hang it up since it has her name on it but like i was saying my um swap partner's name is lillian and what i did was i decorated the background first in like paper so i had some of this paper here that was given to me in a swap so i was ripping it up and i put it on the back then i um took a um q-tip and dipped it in this tropical orange i don't know what it was about me and orange but i had a orange thought in my head today so i just did that i decoupaged the paper on and just stripped the sit around and then i put the polka dots down and then i don't know if you can see it but i took some vellum and i printed her name all over the place it said lillian 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 and then i also printed on vellum and then i um covered it with some uh what's that stuff called i put some uh, gold foil on it and then I ran it through I'm trying to turn it so you can see it you see it so that's what I did and I didn't want to get all crazy but I had a gold frame that was very very gold and that was a part of a um, collection that I had so I thought I would use that and put some um, ribbon about around it and then put it on top of it so you can still see the background a little bit but it's not you know taking up the whole thing because i really wanted this to be the centerpiece so i just um add the vellum on top of it and you know just to bring it up some give it a little dimension and then i just made little clusters all over it, little different clusters but all had the same colors and all that good stuff then i took my paint pen one of my favorite paint pens and just kind of splashed some gold at the end and uh yeah and that's how it looks i'm still trying to get all my little stragglers off here so but this is how it came out isn't it cute i thought it was cute anyway so yeah so this is getting packaged up and waiting for everything to really dry because this key i got is a tim holtz key this is a tim holtz um piece also that i got and i just put a little um modeling paste or whatever it's called gesso or whatever i don't remember what it's called and i mixed it with the um the tropical orange because it had like a peachy color and um i had this these are so old just the strands of um ri um what's it called uh of beads so i just used that as the hanging element it didn't say we had to have one but since mine is not like that box one i just used some of the um flowers that i had and that's that. So um, this is a project that I made for my SWAT partner participating in uh, creating a Crafty Life's website. They're, um, they do swaps every month. So and I participate. I try to participate at least once a month. So this is the um, project for this month that I'm about to wrap up and send on 
over to uh, Lillian. I think she's in Canada. I'm not sure what country she's in. I know she's outside of the U.S. I can't remember. I'm not even going to guess. But she's a nice lady. And I've swapped with her before. So I'm excited. I hope she likes it. So thanks for watching. Until next time. Be blessed.